Hello everybody, I'm Death Savior. I'm doing a video on this on behalf because a person had asked me by the name of Brandon Maser Soy. I'm sorry if I've said that wrong, but they are having trouble with which I'm having trouble with it too, but I kinda have an idea of what's going on now with this last with the la number level ten. Now, I'm going to get into it, and I'm going to show you what I'm kind of doing. I have yet to actually get it to complete. Alright, so, I'm doing this, and then this, and then we're basically, we're making the path for them to get to this. So, we're wanting to block off as much as possible around this to make them have to go further. So we want a tight. Yeah, it's gonna tell us this. But ah, no, I didn't want that. Shit. Now they're basically having to go up, around, and coming back out. We're still building up stuff, so now we can start putting them down. Or now we're setting our thing. Here. This is what they've got to do. Now I'm not going to click next wave because I want to let them. But what we can do now is surround ourselves with something like this. So now we're getting that extra power in. We still have 44, so let's go ahead and upgrade this twice, and this one once. And we're still, because we're letting these uh, little orange spheres respawn around that, so that's why I don't want to click next wave. I want to let it go, and let that stuff respawn up in there. Now we're getting into the harder stuff, but we also now have a that covers pretty much everything. We can start upgrading these as well. Like I said, this isn't going to be perfect. I have yet to actually complete this, but this is the best I actually have done since uh, starting it. They still have not, they may have gotten out with a couple of them, but not many. My main focus is going to be these two here, because they're going to be the first attacks coming in. Especially this. Whoops. I've been upgrading, I've been accidentally clicking and upgrading the wrong one, but... Now, again, I'm just going to let these things respawn, so I don't want to click next wave. Because if you click next wave, as soon as they come in, they can grab these ones that are still here. And start heading back out. Like that one just tried to do. Now, this is where these ones get trickier because they break down into smaller. I believe. It's just a mixture, I'm not quite sure. But now you can see these are taking out my rocket launcher, so that's making it a little more... getting a lot of them before now that the, they're not near that rocket launcher it's able to start taking these things out and then once it gets up here that last one's going to get taken out before it can get out all right so now we can go ahead and continue upgrading we have 300 where's my, there it is. So where's my mouse go we're going to continue upgrading this one and we want to upgrade this one. 
because this is going to be our first line of defense. Now, once, when we start getting like these up on here where we're gaining more points, I'm going to upgrade this a couple of times because this also has a stasis thing. See, now they're grabbing some of them and trying to get out of here with them. And they are getting out. So, I'm not going to get a perfect score. But, they're not getting out with a lot of them. But that's just because these ones do break into. Let's go ahead and upgrade these a little. Now this, I did take this, but that doesn't mean anything. See, now they see those ones are too far out, so they're gonna get away with it. so good. Now see my turret or this is freezing these so they can't move. Come on. Now this is where it got hectic. I started losing, which as you can see, I'm probably going to lose it again. Okay, we kept one. <clears throat> now I want to give that time to respawn back at the thing if it gets a chance because otherwise they're going to grab it and go and I'm going to lose. Even if I lose you kind of got an idea of what I'm saying. Yeah, that's not going to unless it does before they get there. Yeah. Okay. Um, they got back. Okay, so now they got to go through all these. I am sick. But I'm trying to get this out here for people for because there was questions asked. I'm not the best at this game, I'll admit to it.
but we're doing pretty damn good with keeping them out from getting it out with it. But now, in the same instance, like I said earlier, let's get this one up. Oh, whoops. Let's go upgrade this one more time. <clears throat> See, now we got a problem here. They're gonna be able to grab it right here. And there we go. <coughs> See, we've been defeated. Alright. Now, you have, of course, these things in your laboratory. I have yet to unlock a bunch of them, but... I'm not sure on exactly how this stuff works. It depends on, like, what slot you have, when it kicks in on what level. But, this is what I use for my uh, Gatling Towers. This right here gives you faster reload. This gives you energy siphon, which I have it at level 3. This gives you uh, more increases your damage with every hit. This is another energy siphon, so it gives you more. I'm not sure if they stack. I have not, but I. it seems like a, I get more, so maybe I'm wrong. And then I got this for another increased damage, so. And then, since this is the only two I really use, maybe, I mean, maybe I should branch out and try other ones, but. And then I, with this, I'm using the aim protocol for increased attack range, energy extractor on it, um, the stasis 2. Another re reload protocol and annihilation protocol, so it does more damage. Again, I don't know if this goes by as you level it up, how each one of them come into effect, or if they e each go into effect as soon as you set them down. I'm not exactly sure how that works. But that's what I have yet to beat this board, but that's what I'm kind of figuring is you're basically creating the route. That they're going so you're wanting to place it around as tight as a gap as you can pretty much <clears throat> that allows them they will allow you to do more damage with more uh, things so that's why I'm using the Gatling because I can set more of those down at one time <clears throat> to start out and then upgrade them as I can but if you Hopefully this is helpful in what I figured out. Um, I do apologize that it's not the I didn't wasn't able to beat it, but I'm hoping this helps you out in trying to complete this yourself. Also, look into the skills. I'm not sure which one you like best or which one works best for you, but I I always forget to use those, so that that may have been a change for me like a turning point right now I have the stun so I might have been all stun all the like stun up the enemies and things like that but I didn't use it in that one but you, you gotta also remember I think you only get one chance to use it per match uh, round <clears throat> not like wave per like board whatever level but I want to thank y'all for tuning in have a great day Bye.